We could be getting closer to a coronavirus vaccine with promising results from Pfizer and others. For more on the timeline, we're joined by Monsef Slawi. He leads U.S. vaccine development for Operation Warp, Warp Speed. Mr. Slawi, good morning. Thanks so much for being with us. Uh, good morning. We could be uh, just weeks away uh, from a vaccine, uh, the first batch being distributed, according to Secretary Alex Azar. Um, who gets the first doses? And, and how exactly will it be distributed? So yes, we should be, I hope, close to an approval first of the Pfizer vaccine that has shown 95% efficacy. Will be reviewed by the FDA on December 10th and maybe on the 11th or the 12th approved. Within 24 hours from approval, we plan to distribute the vaccine. In the case of the Pfizer vaccine, Pfizer themselves will be shipping the vaccine doses to the uh, exact location that each state uh, will have uh, identified as the areas where they want the vaccine doses. The doses will be proportionately to the population distributed for each state. Now, who will get the vaccine is a very important question that the CDC and its advisory committee for the immunization practices, the ACIP, are reviewing as we speak and will continue reviewing until December 10th. You know, the, the, uh, also the American Academy of, of Medicine has recommended that high-risk people, elderly, healthcare workers, first-line workers yeah. should be part of the first, the first wave, wave of uh, vaccinees. Yeah. yeah. And how long do you think it likely is before everyone will be able to get it? Within the first wave, uh, we think there is about 100, 110 million people. Those should be covered based on our plans between the month of December and the month of February. Now, the U.S. population as a whole uh, should be covered in terms of vaccine doses available somewhere between the month of May and the month of December. So uh, on an ongoing basis, month on month, we'll have more and more doses to immunize, uh, to potentially immunize the full population, which we hope will accept to be vaccinated. Mr. Sly, President-elect Biden says he may alter Operation Warp Speed's vaccine distribution plans. Has, has operation, the, have the people with Operation Warp Speed been in touch with the incoming administration? Has there been contact? We have not yet been in contact. We understand that uh, as of yesterday, the contacts will, uh, will start. Uh, Secretary Azar has said that we are uh, ready to uh, discuss uh, and, of course, share all information that we have, and we will be happy to do it. We think that the plans we have are very clear and, and, and very thoroughly thought through, but, of course, we'll welcome every input. All right. Monsef Slawi with Operation Warp Speed, thank you so much for being with us this morning.